What is happening everybody? Paul here, aka Noob Get Good, and welcome back to Dauntless. And as you can see up there, we're trying to find a neutral patrol. So I thought we might as well do that. Still rocking the same gear that we had in the end of the last video. But I thought, why the hell not? Let's let's push out onto a neutral one. And start getting the uh, the goodies for that. So while we're there, we've got a molten core, grunts molten heart, drops on cooldown. That is pretty decent. To the point where, let's see if I can get it into like the fiery chest plate or something. No. Ideally want this in... There we go. Less damage. It's going to have to be... We'll join that in the mo. Molten spot you, is makes you immune to fire, it seems. So let's let's go. Let's go, indeedy. Threat level four, no significant loadout benefits or drawbacks, that's what you get for neutral. So we've got a shriek, so we've got um must have just ready up here. We've got the owl. Don't really need the molten core here. Even though generally you're going to be using this for fire, so let's just keep the molten core in. So 23 second cooldown per molten core. Which is nice. Increases the dodge and vulnerability window by 21% is amazing. I'm guessing it's in here. That's plus two. How are we doing? 40 seconds. Now this being my better loadout of gear, so if I look at my helms, got the burrow, so that's frost, and then the two fires here. So 45 against 75, so I could do have some neutral, and I want to start working on um, the other equipment as well. I need to get uh, like my neutral and all that other good stuff up. Let's go! Find yourself an owl. Gonna go up here. Grab ourselves some materials. I see it. Flare up. There's the molten core. So 
building up, you've got to see a rocket there. Can potentially do an interrupt on this thing. It's that move where you can interrupt. I think I did it once in a practice. Get a heal up here. Not. damage just liking how aggressive you can be with this weapon it's amazing Mastery level up. So dodge. Failed abysmally on that. that wounding damage in. He's off up there. Yeah, just the war pike is really, really loving it at the moment. Just finding it a nice, different type of You know, different play style to what I had before. I nearly fell down there. damage in. So poor.
to get, come on. Come on, Shrieker. be much left of his health. Then that, uh, like your white damage marker is true damage to his health. Ooh. There we go. I think he's down. Yep. Shriek slain. So that's good. My rank B. Of course it is. Torn Shriek Feather. Got all that loot. Shriek Blade Feather. Got quite a lot of Shriek stuff there, which is nice. We'll try and do another another mission just to see what uh, we can do. Unclaimed rewards. Because we've just unlocked them rewards. There you are. Got a bronze slayer core. Care of yourself. I think I was right. Let's. That was neutral. Let's open these up. Got two of these cores. Flat amount of part damage, quite good. Remove the stamina cost, probably okay. Still, charge still double damage. Um, seems amazing. Increases damage against charged ethers. Got a silver one. Increases max health. That's a flat upgrade to what we've got. Increases wound damage against staggered behemoths. Seems very situational, but it probably means it's decent. Uh, what do we fancy? So if I look at this, so I might as well just be wearing this, unless these give really good dodge and final burn to windows, stagger damage on hit. Okay, that's why they're so good. So we've got so I need eight pieces, I don't have eight pieces, so... A scav. 
Lens Frost. And that's all I can create for the time being. Okay. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. No, tough sell. Might as well go for the plus two. More HP. I'm going to keep the fiery blessed, uh, breastplate on. So we've got maxed stamina. This is that vampiric. So this is what I really want upgrading. Especially with this weapon because you're wounding quite a lot. But anyway. We're going to go on patrol. Didn't really want to do that, so let's get R3. Cancel that matchmaking. Fancy a terror. I want to cancel it. Why is it not? I should prepare and hunt. Oh well. Looks like we're doing another neutral. For some reason, I was thinking, um, we going now? No, I don't know. For some reason, I was thinking, uh, you could go in and choose a patrol to do against. Um, obviously, I was wrong. On the hunt for some of these items still. I think I've got all 10 for today. I tend to run to the same locations as well, which doesn't make life easy. Almost missed you. There we are. Match found, thank you very much. Uh, abandon hunt. It's not the content that I wanted to do. I wanted to do a terror or a shock. Thinking terror here. Start working on them. Well, ideally, I should be working on you know upgrading this blaze armor all the way up, but. I like to try and keep it varied. If I was properly going for it, you'd farm up the this like equipment I've got, so farm up enough of the fire as much as I can to get it. Um, what do you know? So I was come to this Ember main stuff, just push this up as high as I can. So I need two dull air stones two smouldering blood hide and blaze orbs we'll talk again. <sighs> See, what I am hunting for is something like a mastery I can get that information from I'll have a look offline anyway. I, what I want to do is see what drops from which character, you know? Uh, what what can drop from a, a behemoth, sorry. So you far, you know, you can farm up to this point on this uh, behemoth, then you need to go up to the next tier, then the next tier, then the next tier to push it up to the max. It's just me. So we've got a scan. Might as well just ready up, really. Eight percent attack speed for eight seconds after dodging through an attack. Cool. Go 
Come on, Mystic Joker and Mystic F Fin Fire. I've got Mystic Electric as well. How wonderful. Come on, Mystics. Obviously playing the game together. Always nice to see. More of a solo fan myself. Really must go and craft some stuff. So plus six, I mean to being set on fire is gonna be amazing. So I really want to get that wound so it recovers health up. I think that'd be quite overpowered with this build. Or this weapon. So we've got an axe. Guns and two guns. So I, I'm sure I saw the guy and his flary gun. It was fine, you know. I damage on this is immense. Get that wound damage in if you can. Him bleeding. Right, let's get out. Let's get some heals up. Push the wrong button there. So that yellow is sever damage. happening here. If I 
can't stop this. Is this a bug? No. damage 50 damage what's he doing he's going down that's what he's doing Guys. Got my meat. It's not picking up. Sounds like he's up here. this way. Or you want my friend?
thousand damage. It doesn't seem so bad. As he says, it just takes a, a nice hit. Sure, if I had shock here. Damage here. Let's get a heal going here, just on the safe side. And spin. Oh, he's just going ballistic mode. Come on, I dodged that. Got that bleed damage going in. Shield. Yeah. Stagger damage in now as well. We just staggered him a bit. Spin. Heart seekers. Again, got one more heal left. Not very long before he's dead. Wanna make sure we go flawless here. A thousand damage I just did.
There we go. It's gone. Slain. Oh, I did quite well there. A. Yep. Not bad. Not bad. So we've got rock scale, brow scale. Lots of loot. Stone fragments. Hunt pass. Progress reward. Stony hide. So, so what was that? That was terror. I'm thinking of getting, I think weapons at this moment in time are more important than armor. So you get the weapons in to do the damage and if I have a neutral armor, I don't take more damage. That makes sense. I'll take less damage obviously if I use the terror armor. But, you know, a pro player, which, you know, I'm not saying I'm anywhere near, but it's, uh, they can do that whole fight without probably getting hit. So let's We have much to discuss. My see. Dinner damage has a chance based on damage dealt to grant stacking refresh twenty health shield that lasts for twelve seconds. Well that sounds good. That just sounds good. Let's upgrade that again. So we now need six terror orbs to upgrade that again. So that's 220. Only as good as the slayer who we wanted good the equipment. Wondering, oh no, I'm sitting plus 25 frost resistance. That's because of the uh, equipment that I currently got. So we can get potentially all of it actually. Increases max health. 10% of shield applied to you is also applied to your nearest ally. 10, 10 health shield after not getting hit for 10 seconds. Pretty decent. 10% of shield applied, so that was stacked to 20%. Quite like the look of this. We'll push that up. Happy hunting. Excellent. Pillars of stone. Anyway. That's uh, going to be it anyway. I think next time we'll start taking on some terror and shock. We've done quite a lot of frost and uh, blaze. But my name is Paul, aka Noob Get Good, and this, as always, has been Dauntless. <laughs>